All right, so what I got here is a 1948, maybe it wasn't made in 1948, but these are very popular beginning in 1948 through 1955. What it is, is a uranium engineering company, Babel Counter. These were specifically used for uranium mining and obviously locating different types of uh, uranium ore throughout the Colorado Plateau, Four Corners area, um, anywhere that there was common mining back in the 1950s during the uh, uranium boom era. What I've done to get this guy going is I've manufactured some very specialized batteries. These things took three 45 volt B batteries. Um, these things use a standard 1B85 Geiger tube, which are very common back in the day. Uh, that's located here in the front end within this uh, brass plated, uh, not plated, actually it's probably solid brass enclosure for the uh, 1B85. These things also came with an option to purchase the bismuth tubes. Uh, those, I believe, were 6306 bismuth tubes. Um, I do have that version as well. They do provide a little bit higher count rate than these. Uh, they, back in the day, uh, they put them not on an equivalent with a scintillation detector, but they were about as close as you can get to scintillation type detection uh, efficiency by using a Geiger tube. That will be something I'll save for a different video. So let me show you how this thing goes. Okay, so there's the custard cup. Bring this over. Okay. And I, I would not look at this as any sort of accuracy, saying this thing is 25% uh, U308, although it could be. But uh, it all depends on, obviously, what the uranium, uranium content is of this custard cup. Uh, bring it closer, we can max out. So let's put it on a, uh, a higher scale. Okay, so there you have for the custard cup. Let's try some um, gummite ore. Almost 80% uranium, U308, you decide. Okay, before I close out the vid, I'm going to show you a couple of things here. So, these um, probes here in front are removable, and so right now I have the 1B85, and I'd, that is a bismuth probe right there, um, and I could just go ahead and unscrew that, and obviously swap them out, and you'd have... Um, the higher sensitivity of a uh, 6306 type business probe. The other thing it has is a switch here for long and short uh, detection probes. And basically, obviously, this here is the shorter probe. These things also have the option to connecting a very long um, drill hole probe on the end of like a big long tether and cabling system where you can uh, check for uranium in subterranean depths, uh, depending on how long the cable is. And uh, the connecting point for all the cabling is uh, behind this cover right here. Okay, well I hope you've enjoyed the video about the uh, Babel Counter Model 610. And again, if you've got any questions, feel free to ask. Talk to you guys later.